Alrighty boys, welcome back to another campaign run. So previously uh, I did obviously the Lords of the West DLC campaigns, did all of these straight through. Um, what's it called? All of them were uploaded probably like two three days right after launch and that's kind of what I'm hoping for uh, this campaign. We're going to go with um, what's it called this one first, then this one, and then this one. That's how it's listed in the DLC um, section in the new uh, patch notes. Uh, very excited. Obviously, we have the two new, uh, what's it called? What do you call it? The uh, new civilizations, the Bohemians and the Poles, which I think is the Polish, right? And this one, first one that we're playing, we will be playing is the Lithuanians. So uh, I'm going to try to spell it. I'm probably not going to say it right, but Algirdas and the Kestutis. I think that's how you say it. But we're going to do the first one, and uh, yeah, let's do it. Family Matters. I mean, I said family matters, family affairs. But yeah, uh, pretty much I'm going to have a playlist down below in the description with all of this. I'm also going to have a playlist to the previous campaign that I did. And also, probably like two or three weeks down the line, I'm going to do the full campaign for this whole game. And I'm going to put that all of that, pretty much all the missions into one playlist. So anybody who wants to go through the full story of Age of Empires 2, they can actually go and see that. But let's get right into it. Family affairs. You want to know how I ended up here, foreigner? You dare ask such a question as if we were equals? Very well. I will tell you the story, my companion in misfortune. If there is one thing of which we are not deprived in this bloody dungeon, it is time. I aimed for the throne, yet I ended up in this dark, moldy prison cell. Beyond these bars lies the land of my fathers, Lithuania. Its swamps, deep forests, and raging rivers are not exactly the heart of civilization, if you ask our enemies. Which makes it all the more astonishing that they have tried time and again to subjugate it. It began when some chosen ones felt called on to bring the light to Lithuania. They named themselves the Teutonic Order, and under the banner of the cross, they promised deliverance, yet they brought only death and perdition. Lithuania was not easily cowed. Our ancestors learned how to fight by battling the forces of nature and the beasts of the dark primeval forests. Every one of our soldiers is steeped in that same tradition. But the more that we resisted the Crusaders and their god, the more ruthless they became. Slowly, we began to see their true faces. They called themselves holy warriors, but they were nothing more than robber knights. And a hundred years of pillaging our lands had made them masters of their trade. They raised our strongholds and torched our villages. Had Grand Duke Gedimina still been alive, he would have put this mob of greedy crusaders in its place. But a devious coup ended his life and left the throne to his useless son, Eunutis. Eunutis was weak, but worse, he was divisive when the land needed unity. He turned away from our old beliefs and accepted the Christian God. As he failed to control the domestic unrest, the Grand Master of the Teutonic Order saw his chance to subjugate Lithuania for good. However, Eunutis's brothers, Algirdas and Kestutis, refused to stand idly by as their beloved homeland fell to the cross. They exhorted the disaffected princes to dethrone Eunutis, who had barricaded himself inside of the Lithuanian capital. Of Vilnius. Dun dun dun. Alright, alright. Looks like we're gonna have to go uh get him from a castle. It's gonna be one of those missions. Wait for the Algrides and the Kessoids to discuss their plans. Hence uh, this is the th like this is the only thing I don't like about the campaign. I love the campaign missions, but the only thing is I hate is they always make you um restrict your population. But it's it's for fairness, you know. So 150 pop. 
So mainly focused on land warfare. So construction docks is impossible. Okay. The Kestutis. I'm gonna call him the K. Will keep the Teutonic Order in check for you if you help him defeat the enemy. However, he will redirect his forces to help you, even the odds in the battle for the Thwaini throne. Okay. Thwaini rule population laws for peace stability. You'll be able to win the support of neutral villages once you reach the castle age. Okay. Uh, J rules the Lithuanian capital of uh, Vil Vilnius. But you can seize and evict your brother from the city. Do not destroy or may... Do not destroy what may be used for later. Okay, so we can uh, take over it. Do not hesitate to send the Tenius Algridus into combat. Should be wounded, he will retreat to his castle and recover. Okay. Algirdas and Kestuits must initially rely on simple battering rams when besieging enemy fortresses, but it may be possible to steal construction plans for advanced siege equipment by defeating the Teutons. Okay, cool. Alrighty. Tells us where all this stuff is. We'll figure that out. Let's do it. Internal disputes threaten our independence. The Teutonic Knights rattle their sword. Oh. Estimate the threat. Let us put an end to this mischief. Take the throne and prove worthy of our father's legacy. That is how we will do it, my brother. Just keep the order at bay. I will take care of our ineffectual brothers so that they might understand that the affairs of government should not be in their hands okay i recently got two monitors so like if my mouse goes onto other, the other screen uh for some reason this part just like kind of like stops having sound so that might happen a couple times i'm just getting used to two monitors i've had one monitor for so long in my life i just got the two monitor set up and it's pretty life-changing i'm not gonna lie to you but it also comes with its own challenges like certain games kind of like malfunction for some reason all right, so these are the guys that are helping us. This is our ally. Okay. Now, what's our quest again? Okay, so let's do... Okay, so Lithuanians. Start with more food. That doesn't really matter. Uh, skirmishers move 10% faster. Each garrison rally gives a plus one attack. That's pretty good. We're going to get some of those. Uh, mostly cavalry. It's mostly cavalry. Okay. This is the one we need to get to. All right. Alrighty. So if we just keep making villages, we should be straight. Need that as well. Let's get some of these upgrades. We go to Castle Age. Father gave Vilnius to me, making it clear who he considered his heir. Okay. I will work in his thoughts. Raise your hand against me, and you shall die! You cannot scare us, you knew this. We have known you from an early age, and you have always been this pompous knee-high boy that you are evidently still today. Wow. You are all bark. No bite. Oh, you heard it here first. Okay. Alright. Uh, let's get more people on there. Boom, boom. So can I take this over? How do I convert? Oh, it has to be in Castle Age. That, that is correct. Let's keep looking. Go. Boom. 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 Oh. Alright, let's get more of those guys. You three. Need more wood. Let me go right here for now. Okay. I might have to lock my uh, mouse into this first uh, monitor for this. Because I use my mouse to kind of move the map a little bit. And it's getting kind of weird. I'll do it after this mission though. 
Let's get more upgrades. Boom. Another one of those. Okay. Oh, we gotta defeat his wonder. Is that what he's in? Okay. He's not gonna attack, is he? Okay. So we have a good amount of gold, we just need food pretty much. Get it. I might be a little bit slow because I, I haven't played Age of Empires 2 in like a little bit. Not too long, but I take my I take my breaks from this game here and there, but you know what I mean? It's one of those I always come back to. It's actually my second uh, most played on uh, Steam. I looked it up. It's like I think I think I have like this game plus the like Age of Empires 2 like the undefinitive uh, edition. I think I have like 900 hours or something like that. Which I think is like low. I think a lot of people have even more than that. Oh, we could help them defeat Red. That is true. Yeah, we're gonna go do that actually. He's gonna scout this for us, you yeah. know. Alrighty. That's getting him. Sveiki. You. Ah, uh, the way it's made, you can't really even wall this off. To be honest with you, we'll still just start building over here. All right, let's see. How big is red? Is the question. Almost ready to go up to castle too. We got all the buildings. We can build another one of those too. Teach these two ankle fighters a lesson. Okay, so purple is probably like over here. Like beaten dogs and beg for forgiveness before tomorrow dawns. Where's purple? You gonna show up? Let's relax a little bit. We go over here. He'll probably help us. Let's go up and uh. Let's build a front. We're gonna just mass Hussars. I think that should win. Let's do that. Okay. Get more upgrades. Get that closer over there. Also, I kind of want. Why oh, is like yellow? Oh, is it because it's researching? Is that like a new thing they added recently? It's pretty cool. Uh, Alright, cool. I got that. We can chill at this village right now. Uh, Can I go into Imperial Age is the real question. Show yourselves if you are so bold, my defiant brothers. I long for a good fight. Where's he at, bro? Pop up. Uh, I'm guessing they're Lithuanians too, aren't they? A lot of them are Lithuanians, so I think I have to make some anti-cavalry as well. Low key. Let's 
Some of our subjects follow ancient pagan traditions, while others are committed to Christianity. Perhaps we can win both groups over to our cause. Yeah, the monasteries and their stuff, okay. Let's get to it. Uh, so we gotta attack red. Let's just get all the upgrades. Let's get a bunch of these dudes, and we'll just destroy red with mass cavalry. Just mass, mass cavalry. Should be enough to destroy them. Uh, let's build this. What is this? A pagan shrine? What is that? Use to train priests, okay. Oi! I was wondering when they were gonna attack. Do not worry about the Teutonic Knights. I will assure that they do not cross our borders. But I will need the help of your soldiers to wipe out the Order's outpost, Algirda. Oops. A new faith has prevailed in this village. From now on, the inhabitants will see the tenth of their harvest to the church. Okay. And to us, their bonded protectors. Come on. <coughs> Give me more wood. When I get my harvest, man. Alright, let me... Build that right there. Let me get a couple of them boys over there, too. Need more wood. Boom. Let me get that wood upgrade too, when I get a chance. Okay. I think the next step... Fine, boys, relax. I'm gonna get more gold too. That's still getting wrecked. Two has barely an army. Yeah, I think I need to help him now. Uh, let's bring those boys with us. What I get? Yeah, so they do send stuff here. Like I thought. Okay. Alright, now you boys make your way over here. See if they can make it and build that. Oh my god. Well, that's quite the bigger army than I thought. Let me just quickly... No! Let's 
fine. We're stuck on this building, so that's actually okay. So they still need to make it there. Uh, let's go, you two. There we go. go that's dealt with let's just send a bunch of these boys over here bunch of them boys over here we can make a lot more farms Okay. Two, three, four, five. Who's being attacked? <clears throat> my villagers die again? No, my villagers still there. Can stay there. Relax. Get the upgrade. There we go. Ah, I think we should be good to go. What is this? Town center more range, doesn't really matter. Alright, so we're about to take care of your red problem. Well, I should have been got this. Okay. With our help, the new faith has prevailed in this village. From now on, its inhabitants will see the tenth of their harvest to the church. Yes, sir. Give me that tenth, baby. Wanted protectors. All right. We also build a castle somewhere. Okay. Oh, baby, it's okay. We're about to, we're about to invade. About to invade. Should be good very, very soon. So yeah, so. They're all the way in that corner. Okay. And then boys off. And you boys, what are you boys doing after that? You boys. Alright, I think that's enough. Should be. I hope. Ah, perfect timing. Yes, yes, yes. There you go, perfect. Perfect timing. Okay. Let's kill Red. Boom. Then that's a good choke point.
Get him. Now, I don't know if I need to destroy everything in red or if I just need to destroy some stuff. I'm gonna destroy the towers and see how it goes. Okay. While I do that, let's build up an army of those guys over there. Support. Let's go over here. Let's build this. to uh, send these boys over here help, the new faith has prevailed in this village from now on its inhabitants will see the tenth of their harvest to the church okay and to us their wanted protectors Trebuchets? What the heck? Alright. The Order's raiding parties are on the run. I fear that these robber barons will return in the future. And we'll deal with them in the future. Algirdas has been wounded. Quick! Take him to the physicians. We'll have to continue the fight without him while he recovers. Kill it. No. Oh my god, I'm gonna lose my damn. Ah, that is so annoying. Okay, whatever. Way to go, man. I wish my trebuchets killed the castle that quick. I'm sure it would take like 30 minutes to kill a castle. But I guess, alright. Uh, My soldiers capture construction plans for powerful siege weapons from the Crusaders. But nobody in my ranks is skilled enough to understand them. Do you happen to have siege engineers capable of doing so? 
Do not research siege engineers, okay. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna take out pink. I think taking out pink is kind of a waste of time, in my opinion. With our help, the new faith has prevailed in this village. From now on, the okay. inhabitants will see the tenth of their harvest to the church. Close out. Alright. Go back over there. Go that way. Relax. That's all it is. Oh, that ain't really nothing. That ain't really nothing. But okay. Oh, they got those. That sucks. Let's see if we get over here. Okay. Alrighty, we should be good now. You're back, huh? Alright, get in here. has prevailed in this village. From now on, its inhabitants will cede a tenth of their harvest to the church. Cool. And to us, their vaunted protectors. All right, let's uh, go over here. Go over there. Don't want to build that. While that's going on, let's go over here. That is quite a lot. That's okay. A little more over here. Yes, sir. 
Keep him away. <coughs> Get him in there, baby. Alright boys, can we can we can we use the entrance? Like uh please, maybe? Thanks, appreciate it. Sensational work. Alright, that should be good. Get him, come on. Alright, we're good. This is GG. GG, boy. No, what are you doing? You're so close. Get it. Get out of there. Move over. Sensational. Is that not it? Still hasn't really much help, he just keeps getting attacked. <laughs> Alrighty. Alrighty, boys, charge forward. Would you look at that? They made a nice little wooden gate for us here. So we can get into the city. How nice. Battles. Let's take that out. Mm. 
Make some more of those as well, I guess. No! Ah! Why? Oh my god. Oh, that's so annoying. Uh, now I gotta go with these boys. Apart from that guy. Come here, let's build some more of these. Need more gold. Really don't need wood. Alright. Let's keep pushing through. Go, go, go! There we go. Get him! <laughs> Okay. Oh no, that was the wrong one. I don't know why I made those for the Oh wait, I have to get it through there. Oh, I went the wrong way. Whatever. Let's just destroy these. Pretty sure I still have to destroy these. You boys. Building those up. Right. <coughs> so I'll keep. These boys right there. There we go. Alright. Let's go.
Quickly go through the land, see if they're trying to build anything else. They're not. Okay. Go, go, go! Choo, choo! Alrighty. Pretty much should be done. I don't know really what else you could really have. Might take a while, but it is what it is. Next one, go, go, go. Oh, I guess I'll research siege engineers too. Why not? Let's do it. There had to be one. Yeah, yeah, go, 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 go past him. Oh my god, I could attack him with the. <laughs> oh, get in, 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 get in. Oh, yes, yeah, sir. Nice. Engineers deciphered the plans that we had captured. We I think I, st I think I still win this. Powerful catapults. Oh my god, now I can strike. Really? Really? That's what gave us trebuchets? If I would have knew that, I would have got that way earlier. I still won though. Didn't I? And I took technically win? What else do they really got? Some fish over here maybe? There you go. Woohoo! My fortress destroyed! My army smashed! I have no choice but to withdraw after this shameful defeat. There he runs. Marimantas allegedly seeks refuge with the Golden Horde. What a pathetic idea. It will not do him any good. Lithuania is ours. Let us rest and allow our brave men to recover from the fighting. We will meet at the court in Vilnius, my brother. For there is much to discuss. Ah, uh, yes. To seize power is one thing. To keep it is something else entirely. Only a fool declares himself the victor after winning the first battle of a war. As such, Algirdas and Kestutis, the victorious usurpers, knew that their triumph could turn out to be short-lived. The two of them, however, were a different breed than most rulers of their time. Instead of quarreling as their brothers had done, and as most people expected them to, for who had ever heard of two men sharing power? Algirdas and Kestutis agreed to rule Lithuania together. Base. It was a remarkable move, and it showed that they cared more about the well-being of their subjects than personal power. This, of course, did not go unnoticed by the Teutonic Grand Master. He knew that he would have to contend with more formidable opponents from now on. Woohoo! Yes, sir. Look at that, baby. Wrecked. Alright, I'll see you boys in the next one.